Of course, uh, I think uh, the child is very important and uh, because I know I'm a football player and I can help. So, uh, and this is uh, the minimum what I can do. So if I can be involved in any charity, I'll be very happy to do it because uh, for me, it's very, very important to help people. And uh, because we forget every time how lucky we are to have a good health, to, to live in this life. And uh, yeah, I know it's not the money, it's not like how the clothes you wear, but just like to, to have two arms, two, two, two legs and two eyes to, to just, this is like, it is tough. But we forget this, so I think this is important to, to for me to do the strategy stuff. So this year, no, there's so much, so much said nowadays about players being on six-figure salaries every week and, and what have you, and, and people focus a lot on that side of, of football but, and footballers and, and mm. the way they are as people. It's very nice to hear a footballer being very appreciative of what he has. And as you say, you're in a position yourself where uh, you, you've been fortunate to get the, the breaks in your career and to do well in, in your career and it's nice to, to be able to help some other people who are, are maybe not so fortunate. Yeah, but yeah, It's easy like, uh, I don't know what all of the footballers do, do, they, they do with their money, of course, but you don't know like how, many, how much they give to a charity sure. maybe in private, so this is why. So after I think this is uh, very important to every player, to everyone, it's just like one point is maybe nothing for any, any person. So it's very important to give a charity to because some people, they, they need it and uh, we need to be very happy to what we have and uh, I think this is what we forget. The, the good thing as well is that a lot of the players at Rangers are very, very supportive. Uh, and I say a lot, really all the players are very yeah. supportive of the Rangers Charity Foundation. They all get involved in various events and, and it's something I know a lot of the, the players really enjoy doing. Yeah, uh, I, I like, this is one, one of the parts when I like in this team because all of the, this team are very involved in the, in the charity foundation of Rangers, so this is very good and uh, I hope we could keep going and uh, yeah, it's fantastic to see player like open and, uh, and like don't forget like yeah, the real life too. Of course, you've had some fun along the way. You learned to ballroom dance last year. Uh, I take it that's a, a new hobby you, you've not necessarily kept up since you, uh, yeah. you took part in the event last year with the charity foundation. It, it, was, it was very funny. I enjoyed uh, with Heather, so it was my partner uh, who I danced with. Uh, she was fantastic. She helped me a lot because uh, I was a rubbish dancer. I was, <laughs> I, I'm still a rubbish dancer, but I can have a couple of moves. So, <laughs> so yeah, but uh, no, it was uh, it was very good. I enjoyed it and uh, it was for a good cause. So I'm, I, I'm, I, I was very happy and I'm very happy to what I did. Yeah. Did it help you in any way as a footballer? Because obviously you're working on, on quick <laughs> footwork. I, I guess there may have been a wee benefit. You need like the movement. So yeah, I can, this is why I can dribble more player now. <laughs> This is why it's more frustrating because now I have more <laughs> moment that I can't use it. <laughs>